Hi everyone, we're going to try mobilizing the pec major using the cross ball. So the first thing we're going to do is find a, a door frame and put the ball right at the sternal attachment and you're going to roll up and down north-south and we're going to move a little east-west and then back up and down. So you're working right across that pec up and down. As we get right over to the deltal pectoral groove, we can catch a little bit of pec minor right in there. Just roll right up and down, putting some pressure on there, and then I'm back into the pec. Just keep moving the ball. I've got a limited surface here, so I'm just taking advantage of it. Normally you could roll, but I've got to physically move the ball, and I'm just rolling around in pec. And I've got some good points here. So now I'm going to pin, and I can extend my arm, oh that feels good, and extend my arm, then I'm going to retract and externally rotate. Retract and externally rotate, which are all the opposite actions of pec as I'm pinning it. Externally rotate, then I'm going to horizontally abduct as I externally rotate. So that was pretty good. I'm going to find another spot on there pretty tender and I'm going to go through the same process. I pin the pec, extend the arm, I'm going to retract, externally rotate while I'm pinning and then I'm going to do horizontal abduction with some external rotation. And that gets right into that pec. I don't know if you can tell my shoulders, I can feel this arm is much longer. You can see or maybe I'll go this way. It's quite a bit longer, and you can see how that shoulder's dropped down. Uh, my colleague Kelly Sturet has a website called Mobility Wad, W O D. Check it out. He's got all kinds of variations, and sometimes he's even got his daughter <laughs> making noise in the background of the videos. Thanks, everyone.